Hello there. Today we are going to unbox iPad Pro 2018 model 12.9 inch 256 GB. Let's do it. So let's see what's inside of the box. So we've got a new iPad and what else Apple put in charger. Supposed to be 18 watts cable, USB-C, USB-C, both connectors. And paperwork. Some basic manual. And Basically, one more thing, Apple stickers, in this case, I don't know if you can see it, but they are a little bit grey, they are not completely white, so they are kind of matching the iPad, particularly this one is the Space grey. And of course, Apple Pencil, the new one, because the old one is not working with the new iPad. And the new one is not working with the old iPad. So, we are kind of forcing to buy also Apple Pencil because most of us are using Apple Pencil with iPad so there is not really other choice so what we've got here some paperwork more paperwork manuals that's it Mm-hmm. They wrap it. Uh, I picked the engraving with my name, Blood. So let's unbox it. The tip is the same unscrable but there is no cap and uh, it's uh, this uh, the one part is flat or flatten there is that magnet which uh, is causing that the Apple pencil is uh, can be attached to iPad and obviously can be charged which uh, we will see later on so let's uh, put it here and uh, Let's have a look at this bad boy. So this is the Apple's new iPad 2018 model. As you can see, uh, the bezel is all the same. It's a space grey model. This side is... There is just one little tiny dot, which I guess it's a microphone. And from the bottom, also speakers with grills. And uh, 
USB-C port. From this side is the smart connector for the uh, sleeve or the case. And uh, on the bottom is just uh, name iPad and uh, made by uh, designed in California. Flash, that's it. As you can see, the bezels are equal everywhere. On top is a camera and a face ID camera. So basically that's it. Let's switch it on. But first I wanna try this uh, Apple Pencil, how it works. So this is the top of the iPad. So it, the connector, oh yeah, we forgot. The connector uh, for the charging of uh, Apple Pencil is on this, let's say, right side. Oh, it's holding. Ah, oh, if you put it, it's pretty solid and it's basically, it's pretty tough. As you can see, it's pretty tough. Well done, Apple. Uh, when it's exactly in the middle of the iPad, it's holding the best. But I see you can you can yes in the middle that's the hot spot. Okay, it's pretty thin, 5.9 millimeters, and yeah, it feels quite light. This is my current iPad Pro 2.12.9 inch. So let's uh, compare it. If we align two sides, this is the difference. So the width is just slightly bigger but the length as you can see let's see the screen screen size is the basically is the same but as you can see the corners of the old iPad are squarish and uh, in the new iPad they are round so uh, that's the difference uh, the double tap should be working Oh yes, it's working, perfect. Okay, so the iPads are next to each other and uh, it's, just, it's suggesting uh, set up new iPad. So let's do it. Okay, we have to scan the code. Perfect. Let's compare the weight. Well, it's it feels a little bit heavier than the original one. Let's have a look again. The speakers are improved. We will check it up later. USB C at the bottom. camera and uh, let's try how the Apple Pencil works. So let's take it up. Ah, pairing. Apple Pencil, would you like 
to use this Apple Pencil with your iPad, connect. Use apps, uh, so some instructions. Double tap. That's it. Pairing of uh, Apple Pencil is uh, easy and quick. Let's connect it again. Apple Pencil, 50% charging. Perfect. Let's see. Apple Pencil, as you can see, is being charged. And as I see, they improved my AirPods are at the moment in the case closed and uh, it's showing them all the time also the each of it they are obviously now charged all of them and uh, it's uh, showing the percentage of the batteries but uh, before before that there was just a sign for battery of apple airpods only when they were active now as you can see you can see all the time your the battery okay so let's uh, run the geekbench so we will see how the ipad is performing let's uh, run it side by side by side the new one and the old one well that's it results are here single core score 5062 comparing to whew, old one is 3148 oh my god multi-core multi -core score is 5306 on the old one and 18,079 on the new one they are both running iOS 12.1 they both have uh, 4 gigs of memory but uh, the difference is just astonishing let's uh, do the compute benchmark oh my god so the old one is 16,087 and the new one is 42,169 that's more than double it's absolutely incredible obviously because it's powered by the Apple A12 chip I bought this iPad uh, mainly for uh, one reason and that is uh, I'm using LumaFusion for editing uh, my videos uh, from uh, my cameras and uh, also from my drone most of them are 4k 60 frames per second so I can't wait to check it up and of course also this video was uh, edited in uh, new iPad and uh, I cannot wait uh, how it will perform and uh, old iPad was uh, handling the 4k videos in LumaFusion quite well which means the new one will have no problems even if I will have the uh, bigger video files or a few of them with some transitions effects etc etc so I can't wait for that to see and to check it up so that's all for now thank you very much for watching uh, stay tuned and uh, check also my other videos thank you very much see ya guys bye